Hey guys, my name is Justina Shea. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to be taking you guys Black Friday shopping with me. So if you're ready to do a little shopping, stay tuned. Hey guys, like I said, my name is Justina Shea. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Here on the channel we talk all things beauty, fashion, lifestyle, travel, Basically, if I like the topic, we're probably going to be talking about it. I am taking you guys Black Friday shopping with me. If you're new here on the channel, I do upload on Thursdays and bonus videos on Tuesdays and Sundays. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited to take you guys shopping with me. So let's rewind the tape because this is after my shopping trip. So we're going to rewind the tape, take you guys on that shopping trip, and then we are going to end the video by me showing you guys what I picked up this weekend. So yeah, let's get to it. Okay guys, so like I just told you in the intro, I am going to take you guys shopping with me. It is Black Friday weekend, because at this point, the sales will end on Black Friday. But I just want to show you what I'm going to be wearing. So I have this plaid. It has like a rust and beige, um, like lines through with, go, running through it, um, shacket. I'm going to be wearing my Skims. Um, you know what, I don't know what it's called, but I'll have anything that... I have here linked below. This is just some fresh Nike socks. Um, these are actually like brown sweatpants from American Eagle. Um, my mom actually gave me those. So, shout out to her. I'm going to be wearing a pair of Desi sunglasses. I'll show you guys the outfit once I put everything on. I'm going to be wearing a pair of these. I didn't want to show you guys these until I did what I got in new video, but that's okay. And then as far as sneakers are concerned, I have these two options. So, these are like some blazers, love those. And then I have these like pony haired um, Nike sneakers, but yeah, I'm probably not gonna feel that with the socks. So yeah, this is what I plan on wearing today. Um, it is a little bit cold outside, but I'm gonna be in and out of the car, so I'm not worried. So I'll show you guys everything once I get dressed. So actually, I this is actually um, Skims uh, da, 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 shapewear. I love these. So this was like before the bodysuits came out, and I've been obsessed ever since. I've literally, I think I ordered Skims the first time it came out. Um, so this is Skim shapewear. I like to wear it underneath my clothes because it's a little bit more thin, and it definitely snatches. Um, so then I have the Zara little jacket. As you can see, it's not that long. And then I have on the brown sweatpants from American Eagle. This actually comes as a set, but I was like, that might be a little bit too much. And then I decided on going with the Nike blazers instead of those short ones, only because they looked a little crazy with the socks. So yeah, um, and I just wanna show you guys again with my bag of the day. Um, I decided on putting on Carolina Herrera, a uh, very good girl as my perfume. And yeah, so that's my little outfit of the day. Um, this, one thing about these um, shapewear bodysuits, they are see-through, so you're gonna wanna keep it closed, but they definitely do snatch. As you can see, my waist is like, so small with this, so yeah.
I hope you love the little impromptu shop with me. Um, I was even I even put in some like little get ready with me. I'm like, I'm feeling this. Like, and I think you guys really like the vlog content as well. So I'm gonna keep um, you know, trying to do that a little bit more often, although it is a lot more in my wheelhouse to do the sit down videos but i'm gonna give you guys what you're wanting because it seems like the vlogs do a lot better on the channel um definitely comment down below if you feel that way as well um so yeah without further delay let's get into the items that i picked up yesterday because yesterday i went um shopping on black friday but i went to woodbury commons for anyone who's from the new york city area you definitely know what that is very nostalgic for me i love going there on black friday i go there get my hot chocolate it's cold outside everybody's bundled up love it but yesterday it rained um terribly like pouring so i will insert a little bit of uh, footage from that if you haven't seen it already um so yeah i didn't vlog there obviously because it was pouring i did bring my cameras with me i had them with me and everything but today i wanted to bring you guys out with me figured i'd give you a little bit of extra by showing you a little bit of the get ready with me process but yeah so let's get into the items first that items that i'm going to show you are from hunter i picked up two pair of boots and a bag now hunter obviously if you don't know is um a brand that is basically famous for their rain boots um but they do have clothing they have bags and stuff like that and the only reason why i kind of know that is because i do go to the hunter store at woodbury commons which is considered an outlet um of the hunter brand um they had a 20 percent off um discount for black friday which was really really good so yeah i picked up three things so the first thing that i picked up was this book bag um, I like to have book bags like this in my closet just so that if I needed to run out, usually I use them like on vacation and stuff, but I figured this would be nice to have to match my rain boots because, you know, when it's raining outside, you kind of want to be like hands free. You don't really want to get your handbags wet. This is like a nylon material, so it is waterproof and it just has one big opening, nothing too crazy. It doesn't even have a pocket inside. Um, I believe this was $80 and then I got the 20% off. So yeah, super cute book bag. It even has like a, uh, something on the side to hold a water bottle. Oh, actually on both sides, I hold a, wa hold a water bottle. So it's super cute. The handles are like see-through. They just have like a sil simple netting material. So I really, really thought that that was cute. So I wanted to pick it up to match my rain boots. So the boots that I picked up were the Hunter Chelsea rain boots. So these are in a size eight. They do run true to size. Um, super cute, sleek rain boot. Um, I have had the, um, I have had the full length, like below the knee rain boots before, but my calves do not fit in them anymore. <laughs> full disclosure. So I also find that these are a lot chicer in my opinion. Um, a little bit more understated. Um, than the full rain boot um they also look very cute to dress up so i wanted to grab these in the matte black because i do have these in two other colors i have them in a classic yellow rain boot which is shiny and then i also do have them in a bright pink which is shiny and people like stop me to be like i love those rain boots they look really really cute in that color um so, so like the next I, said, I did get 20 percent off of of all of these items whatever I can find in link below I will definitely do so but obviously you might not get the 20% off and I will try to see if there's other hunter outlet stores and I'll try to link those or, or maybe put those cities in my description box so you guys can try to find out where they are so the next item that I picked up was kind of more like a practical purchase and it was a pair of hunter snow boots now these aren't the cutest, chicest snow boots in the world, but I will say that they look a lot better when they are on your foot. Um, they just have a gray with the classic, like, you know, regular um, snow boot at the bottom and the hunter sign right here. Um, and they do have like a little drawstring back here, which makes them kind of cute when you put them on. I will say that they look a lot better on your feet. Um, the reason why I bought these, if you guys do not know, I do live in New York City, so we get the rain, we get the sleep, we get the snow. Um, and yeah, even though you might want to look cute, you do not want to get caught outside in the wrong shoes. I've actually broken my ankle like that, guys. Um, I actually broke my ankle when I was like, 12 or 13 in the snow wearing a regular Ugg boot. So you, you just don't want to get caught doing it. You just don't. You just don't. 
Um, and plus I'm planning on going on a ski trip, so I feel like these will be perfect. Um, so like I said, not the cutest shoe in the world, but definitely practical if you live in a climate where it does snow. And with the 20% off, they were $60. So we're going to get a deal if we can. I don't care how not cute the boots are. Um, so the next few things that I'm going to show you, I'm trying to think if I'm thinking. So from Woodbury, I also did grab some things from the Gap, but I mean like, Y'all yeah, want to see some leggings. I got some leggings and the other things that I got were gifts. And obviously I'm not going to show them in the video because then people are going to know, you know, before Christmas. And I hate not having the element of surprise for my gifts. So the next thing today. So I also did order a lot of stuff and obviously I can't show you guys that stuff because it hasn't arrived yet. I did purchase it on Black Friday so maybe I'll do a little short video aside from this one showing you guys what I ordered for Black Friday. I shopped the Skim Sale. Um, I bought another pair of Desi sunglasses. Terrible. Um, terrible because I shouldn't have. Um, I can't think what else y'all. But I'm also thinking of doing a new in, like new in this week or new in this month video. So maybe I'll put those items in that. Not really sure, but we're going to get it together. So the next, I did, like I said, that was all I got at Woodbury Commons. Um, then today I did go to a few places. Uh, the next thing I'm going to, the next item I'm going to be showing you are from the store Lush. Now, if you don't know what Lush is, Lush is a cosmetic store. They have bath bombs, body lotions, bath, um, massage bars. Um, exfoliators they they have it all if you love if you know like someone who's either who like likes self-care items it's a cute store everything's colorful bright fun um, and the good thing about them at this time of the year is that they have pre-packaged items so as you can see it has this beautiful wrapping paper and I can't see if I have it else there. oh yeah so it has this little tag on it it says dreaming of Christmas super cute the packaging super bright colorful and this package does come with a body lotion a shower gel and a, bo a shower bomb I will try to link this down below if I can this one was I think $30 I believe um, but it comes pre-packaged like if you just want to go somewhere get something cute and get it done and get it over with then I definitely suggest that now the next item that I bought goes with my sister's gift and it's just literally a tin box a tin box and you'll see why I got the tin box in a minute um this is called the sunset box there's nothing special about this it's literally a tin box so um but it's super cute if you have like little trinkets you want to put together or if you want to go into Lush and guys this was only six dollars so if you want to go into Lush and get this as well as like a bath bomb and then fill it with other stuff this is super cute to wrap gifts in sometimes you buy stuff that's hard to wrap so that would be perfect so the next thing that I picked up if you don't know Lush for anything else but their cosmetic stuff they have these beautiful scarves and I'll kind of like pull it in and show you the details on this one super cute it has like a kind of like a galaxy type theme it is called twilight this one is called twilight i don't know how much i paid for this i want to say it was under ten dollars um but i'll link everything that i purchased down below so you'll definitely they didn't have a sale on lush but like i said i just wanted to show you guys everything that i got this weekend so this is a cute super cute scarf and what they do in lush is they'll take items such as the tin box They'll put it in the scarf and wrap it up and make it really, really pretty. So instead of using gift wrap, they'll use the scarf as like the wrapping paper, which I really think is super cute. So the reasons why I bought those two gifts for my sister is because I want to do a little little trickery, little switcheroo. I wanted to think I bought her something from Lush. When in all reality. When in all reality. System got something from Louis Vuitton. Um, by the time this video is released, she's gonna already know what she got as her gift, so no big deal. Um, so I will show you guys the item that I purchased her. If you have been watching my videos for a while, then you probably already know what this is. If you have some type of idea, pause the video, comment down below, tell me what you think I purchased her. 
Um, so yeah, this is one of my favorite Louis Vuitton items. Um, it came in the box with the gold lettering. If I'm not mistaken, the gold writing is particular to the holidays and it usually comes with a red ribbon that also has gold um, writing on the ribbon. Um, but for some reason, my regular essay wasn't there, so I didn't get the gold, the red ribbon. Um, maybe they ran out of it because of the, you know, the Black Friday weekend. Um, so basically it comes with the pull draw like that. Pull it out. Little dust bag. And you can kind of hear what I got her. But what I ended up purchasing her was the Louis Vuitton six key ring key pouch in the monogram leather. Or monogram canvas, I should say, because if you don't know, all of these, all of this stuff like this is not leather. It's canvas and it's coated, but that's a discussion for another day. Um, so it has these rings in it. You just literally slide your key in and this houses your keys so effortlessly, just nice and sleek and compact. And you don't have to worry about the inside of your purse getting damaged from your keys because it is protected with this little pouch. Um, I will link the videos where I show this item before because I have one with a fuchsia button and a fuchsia inside so if you want to see that I will link the video in the cards but if you guys are looking for a luxury item um that is under $300 um that will definitely make an impact when the person first gets to this they'll probably be like what the hell but when I tell you guys I have purchased I'm trying to think if I bought my mom one uh if I didn't buy my mother one, I definitely put her on to this item. Um, my boyfriend, I bought him one. He's in love with it. He actually has two now from me. Um, he's in love with it. Um, one of my friends, I put her on to this. She loves it as well. It's just like top tier. One of my favorite SLGs. So yeah, that's what I purchased my sister. I hope she loves it. I'm pretty sure she will because I'm, you know, I set the, I set the, I set the uh, tone for this family. <laughs> so I'm sure she'll love it. So I'll give that to her this upcoming Thursday. And it, this video should be releasing on Thursday. So it'll be, either be on Thursday or Sunday. So by then she should have already seen her gifts. So the last item that I purchased was this coat. Oop. All right, let me the camera. So the last thing that I purchased was this coat from Zara. It is literally just a green puffer coat. I will insert a video of me trying it on for you guys. Um, I'm showing you guys mainly because this this coat was on special price. You know how those have those items in Zara that are on special price? It retailed for $89. And obviously it's going to be linked below. Retail for $89. And it is on sale for $49.90 so super amazing price um like I said I'll insert some video of me trying it on so you guys can see what it looks like but super cute coat puffer warm super thick um so yeah guys that was everything that I picked up this weekend which I feel like I picked up more but I didn't um I definitely left some items out because some of them are gifts and I hate to ruin gifts for people um so yeah that was everything that I picked out that I can show you. Super glad you guys decided to tune in today for another video. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Like I said, comment down below if you are enjoying the vlog style content because I need to know what y'all are feeling and what y'all ain't feeling. Um, do not forget to like the video, comment down below like I just said, and also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you love the content. I love you guys so much for helping, I mean not for helping, for tuning in. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.